I'm here to get more acting work, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> uh, good, I've been here for four weeks and just doing the meetings and all that sort of thing. I haven't got an agent yet, so I have to do that. Yeah. And then pretty much start all over again. <laughs> Um, it was six years that we spent filming it, so it was it was pretty crazy. It was a little bit surreal, like we didn't really realise it had properly finished, I suppose, by the end. It was just kind of, yay, holiday time, and then I was happy to um, be able to move on to other projects and play different roles, just because, you know, you sort of, after six years. But um, yeah, it was also, yeah, it's sad. Mm. Um, I enjoyed the people, the crew and the other actors and everyone involved with it um, and also just the work itself, like it was an amazing experience and I learnt a lot. So. I don't think so, I don't know, who knows, it might happen but um, Frank passed away, Frank Whitten, so I'm not sure they could do it without him. Yeah, it was really sad. It was um, after we'd finished filming, a, lot, a long time after actually, like almost a whole year, and um, we all got together and it was good to see everybody, and, but it was really sad. Not really. I do get asked this question a lot and they're, they're, I don't think there's many similarities apart from our shoe size. We don't even dress the same. We don't even wear the same size clothes. So, not really. I'm, I think I'm a lot more ballsy and maybe a bit more confident than I was before I started. But that might just be my age, you know, I was 21 when I started, now I'm 28. So, um, but yeah, I think that side of her, I hopefully have learnt a little bit because she definitely speaks her mind. <laughs> Um, I'd like to think that they lived happily ever after. Um, they probably went off to some little tiny rural country town thing and, you know, went hunting and all that sort of stuff, which Pascal, I think, would have been amazing at. <laughs> she would have been a good shot. So I think, I don't know, I think they probably maybe had quite a simple life and hopefully made up with Robin, well, with Cheryl, and yeah. Well, since I've been in Australia, I have been watching Australia's Amazing Race because I love it and it's got Grant in it and he was my dad. And, um, but I like all the Aussies on it. They're really funny. They're really good TV, like the Cowboys. And Do you know what I like about it actually? Because I watched the American one as well. And the Australian one, um, they help each other out. You know, it's this competition for all this money and they just help all the other teams out. It's really, it's really nice. Hmm. <laughs> Um, I'm actually not sure at the moment. Robin is in Auckland. Ant seems to be all over the place, like all the different countries. Um, Tammy Davis, I saw him here about two weeks ago. He's He's been writing and doing short films and things, so I saw his short film in a little festival over here. So he's doing, he's busy doing that sort of thing. And yeah, they're all just kind of getting on and trying to get more work and, you know, doing that. Um, yeah, for me, I had a, I had a heaps of really great times because it was, you know, so long, but um, probably one episode where Pascal was engaged to Bruce, the Indian doctor, and she had an, um, an engagement, like a hen's night, and so all the girls, we got to just play all day long, and we just laughed, and we would have been driving everyone up the wall, but it was good fun. <laughs> Thank you for watching Outrageous. Um, I had a really great time and I'm so pleased it was so popular so that we kept filming it. <laughs>